Thanks for being here this afternoon. We're going to start with a freight train that crashed into a stolen car in northern Illinois. This was actually a chain of criminal events that began in Kenosha County and led up to it. And the search for one of the people involved is still on this afternoon. Our Taylor Lumpkin is putting together all the pieces of this story that is still developing. She is live in Pleasant Prairie right now. Hi, Taylor. Hey, Vance. Yeah, it all started here at this BP gas station in Pleasant Prairie, where an armed robbery took place overnight. Police say shots were fired and two suspects ended up stealing an employee's car before fleeing the scene. Now, I spoke with a BP store clerk earlier this morning. She says the employee is wasn't injured and is home recovering today. She says the victim was new and had only been working at this gas station for a couple of months. According to police, the armed robbery occurred just after midnight later. Officials confirmed that the same stolen vehicle was hit by a freight train and pushed for a nearly a mile near Route 173 and 9th Street in Zion, Illinois. Lake County Sheriff's deputies have taken one suspect into custody, but police are still searching for the second suspect who may be armed. Police say he may have exited the vehicle prior to it being hit by the freight train. Now, as for the gas station, one employee says it's typically a quiet area and something like this has never happened before. Around here, everything in front is nice. You know, it's just it's sad that you can't even go to work without, you know, being felt safe or really go anywhere anymore. So just hope nothing happened to me. Police say this incident is still under investigation, and if anyone has any information regarding what happened, they're asked to call the Pleasant Prairie Police Department as soon as possible. Reporting live in Pleasant Prairie, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News, Vince.